if I want. From here, I could go ahead and control the the display settings as well, the, the brightness and all that. Very cool. Uh, auto brightness. Um, here in the bottom, you can see this test bar right here across the screen. You can see the, op the apps that are open in the background. Click here, go back over here. I could jump through apps like this. Like you see, very, very cool. That is a very cool feature. Of course, this also works on phones, but for me, it looks a lot better on tablets because you get a bigger, better real estate as well. Um, also here, these are all the open apps in the background. If you click right here, it will automatically kill everything and uh, release a little bit more memory for you. Makes a little bit, uh, the tablet a little bit faster. Of course, this icon right here, you can move it anywhere you want. You could put it right there if you want. You could put it up here if you want. Click right there. Boom, automatically. Uh, you also, if you tap right there, it will automatically hide the icon so you will not see it. To see it again, you would have to tap right here and now you have, like you see right there, now you have the icon available. But the good thing is that it doesn't stay a solid color. It goes back to trans, like translucent. You tap right there. Of course, this app is totally free, but uh, you could get a paid version uh, that will let you customize. Let's go ahead here to settings. Uh, you could do, do a couple things here, but to customize, uh, for example, the start button icon, like you see right here, this is the icon that I have right now. If you choose other icons, that little icon will change. But for that, you would have to upgrade to a pro version, which includes remove ads, uh, create unlimited folders, uh, pin unlimited items on taskbar, change theme, and change start button icon which is very cool. From here, you can also um, control the height of the taskbar as well, like you see here. Uh, the, also the height of the task menu as well and transparent. You click right there, it will automatically, um, uh, uh, it should automatically, like you see right there, not on me. Now that I made it very, very small. But of course, you could go back and change that as well. Let's go ahead back here, make it larger again. Of course, you can also create, let me see, you can also create um, folders as well. Like you see, uh, let's go back, boom, boom, boom. Let's see if it, it didn't adjust right now. But like you see, you have a folder here. You can adjust that folder and you can put um, as many apps you want in that folder. Uh, right now, I have only one, but I think if you want to add a lot more, you actually have to pay for the pro version. Um, also, here, if you tap right here, okay, now it went up. Over here, you could change the, the picture you can see there. Right now, I can see my picture, but you could go ahead and change it to any picture that you want. Very cool. And not bad. Honestly, I think this is a very cool app, especially for Android tablets. It looks a lot better because of the bigger screen. Um, totally free to play. This is not a new app. This has been in the App Store for a long while. And I did try it a long time ago, but on my